So let's talk about the future a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you see? I, I, I see a great planet coming, a great uh, awakening. A absolutely. And it's moving very rapidly right now. We are getting a tremendous amount of help from these higher civilizations, galactic civilizations. They're there. They're supporting us in many, many ways. They're making linkages with leadership on this planet. There is a very well-organized, what we call the Galactic Earth Light Alliance, which is a combination of human beings working with galactic civilizations. They provide tremendous energy support. They have helped clear out some of the negative control forces. And they are more and more fully implementing this plan where we're going to reform, redo and reorganize the financial systems, the political systems, the media. It's all going to come under when? a new system. When? Yeah, That's good the, question. The, the million dollar question everybody has. When? Well, it's dependent on what we do as humanity, how fast we wake up, which we are moving very, extremely well right now. Right. And it depends on certain alignments that are being made in the solar system which will allow this inflow of this beautiful quality and level of love energy that we've never seen on this planet before. Really? Yes, and, and a, at a higher frequency of love than we've ever had. Well, you're incredibly loving. I mean, you're just emanating something. Thank there. you, thank you. Yeah, so that's <laughs> uplifting yeah. people that come in your field. So mm -hmm. would you say, though, if we're going to be a little concrete, 10 years, 15, 20 years? Less, less, less. 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 Less than all of those. Less than all those will have a restructuring of all our system, political, That's my. Social, that's economic. what I'm getting. That would be great. Isn't it? What can, <laughs> we, what can people do? Well, the most important thing is to realize that the status quo is, is no longer acceptable, uh -huh. that demanding and visioning the kind of world we want to live in don't give your attention and energy to the, what's dying. We don't want to watch the decaying corpse. We want to focus on what's being born, create that whole vision of that new world, how would you like society to be? That image, that understanding is encoded in your cells. It's mm -hmm. in your consciousness. You, you go there at night. You go there when you're in deep meditation. You may not remember bringing back that, but it's there in your soul. And that vision, which is shared worldwide, if you, they've done interviewing, check, you know, all over the world. People have the same vision. I think so. They do. They do. The, the, the good do. people yeah. of the world want to see everyone take, have enough to eat and be, feel yeah. good. Governments and, are in the way. Yeah, and the government is, be responsive and fair to the people, that people are creative and enjoying life, have beautiful communities and good places to live. All that is a world vision. It's in the soul of all of us. Yeah. It's our, it's our, all the world our, all our hearts long for. Yeah. And so it's there. It's coming in from these higher levels. That's where we want to give our attention. Yeah. We want to support every initiative, everything we can see in the world that is working, working towards that. Mm -hmm. And we want to support people who are doing that, create visions and projects that actually help make that happen. Mm -hmm. you know? And invite and invoke the support, energy, and help of the spiritual masters and these higher galactic civilizations, which are primarily on all positive. Hmm. They are not I think so harmful. Too. They are not. If they, they, they are not. They would have done whatever they needed to do, although there is, was a force field around the, the yeah. earth stopping us and yeah. keeping us in limitations. Yes, that's, uh, that's being broken up. It's been broken up, absolutely. So if you can leave, like people, or can you access, can you channel, like us, some message from these Syrians? There is the possibility of surfing a tsunami of love which is so potent that it will wash away every limitation, every blockage, and bring in a huge wave of openness, revelation and ultimately the transfiguration of our world in ways we cannot even yet at this time conceptualize.